Do you know why I'm wearing this today? It's because it's nearly Christmas! And today at my school they had Christmas lunch. So we got like crackers and stuff like that. And this is what I received from my crackers. The tiny pokers. Oh, so cute isn't it? Anyway, when I look at this, I realize for me, each of these is just like one life. And people say we only have one life. That's why live. But live only is not enough. We only have one life. That's why we need to live sensibly. I think one of the most important thing to live your life sensibly is to be happy. Why do you need to be happy? It's because when you're happy, you actually can do things properly and you feel like your life is more meaningful. It all starts with love. Do you feel happy when you do things you love? Of course you do. Therefore, you need to do what you love to be happy. But what if you can't do what you love and you really have to do things you hate? So the answer is try to love what you hate. I know it's not easy, it's actually really hard because I used to hate what don't belong to me, what I'm not familiar with and what I'm not good at. We, we just can't avoid them. You will need to face them someday. I have been facing some of those stuff and I know that in the future, I'll face them again. So I've learned myself a lesson. Every time I feel like a sense of resentment raised inside my blood, like, oh my god, I can't do it. I hate it. I just hate it so much. When I calm down, I start asking myself one question. Why do I need to hate it? Should I just love it instead? So maybe what don't belong to me will belong to me. What I'm not familiar with will be familiar with me. And maybe I'll be good at what I'm not. Of course, it's not as easy as just saying like that. It's actually really hard, especially with people you don't like. Anyway, what you get from it, your anger, you're not happy. She ruined my day, just look to her face. You just can't do things properly after that. And where's my key? See, it's not sensible. I used to hate Cambridge, where I'm living now. I challenged myself to love it someday, because I realized that I just can't do anything in Cambridge if I hate Cambridge. So I learned by myself to love it day by day. Now I feel like it's a part of my body, a second home. All over the world, people do different jobs, people do different things. But at the end of the day, they only want one thing, to feel content. That's why happiness is very vital. But it doesn't mean that you can't be sad, or angry, or depressed because you need those emotions to make life more colorful. Just let out your tears and your screams when they are needed to. And after that, please do stand up and smile because believe me, smile is the best curve of your body. Okay, we'll call that a short talk then. Overall, being happy is just the main key. And as long as you are doing what you love, or you potentially will love, you feel super uber duper happy. And if you feel super uber duper happy, you'll find your own way to live sensibly.